Can we do that thing again? Can you put that that uh that that uh tissue box right under the camera? So Anthony, what we're learning is that like I have no nothing to focus on over there because everything's washed out because of the lights in my eyes. And so if I see something white, I can look at it. Do you need a test? You got it? Uh, I left it back there. I don't know if I turned it off or not this time. I'm sorry. Oh, wait. That's awesome. Something like that. Dude, I got to work out. Do you, Jackie, you got any of those lactation cookies today? <laughs> Tim needs them. That's why that's why I brought it up. <laughs> Your baby in your wife's belly? Give me some cookies. <laughs> oh, what's the, what, what am I coming in after? What is the video? If you don't mind, it's helpful to know in case I want to bridge it. But if it's hard, no big deal. That's great. Yeah. Yeah, that's good. So, Anthony, right off the bat, I'm going to ask, how do you respond to conflict? But I won't go into those three. You don't need to put those up until I say those three. I just didn't want to confuse you any more than I already do. Hey, Canyon View family and uh, all of those watching online, you might be watching on your, I don't know, your iPad or your phone or your TV or something else, or maybe you're driving. Uh, I just wanted to welcome you guys. And throughout our experience here together, please feel free, use the comment section, uh, things that you are encouraging you, hit the little heart button, like let's really interact together as we uh, do this thing and we experience the amazing... Word of God, which is so good. So that video, Conflict Revolution, right? <laughs> and there were a variety of ways in which that person responded 
to that, uh, that text. And there's a variety of ways which we respond to conflict, as you know. I know that I have been a total moron when it comes to conflict at certain times. And I'm trying to grow in that. And so here's a question for you, right off the bat. Wherever you're at, how do you typically respond to conflict? Like, think about your life and your moments. We have conflict, don't we, with family or workplace or ideologies. And I mean, conflict is part of life. Why is it a part of life? Because the kingdom of God is already and it's yet to come. And so because we have sin in our heart and other people have sin in their heart, conflict is a part of our experience until Jesus returns. And so I'm curious how you respond typically to conflict. And feel free to even put it in the comment section, like, what's your response? And you can make fun of yourself a little bit if you'd like to. Because here's what we're going to look at today. This is an important premise, an ethos of how we see the world. Conflict. That's okay. He didn't like my opening. So we cut it. Oh man, these are dirty. Yeah, I'll just start over. It's easier for me if I just start over. If that's if that's okay. <laughs> 